This video will teach you how to push or transfer items from Epi Reviewer to Zotero and back again in order to bulk upload PDFs. In this review, I have 79 items that I've already identified to include on title and abstract. I've already uploaded some PDFs, but I would like to upload more. On the review homepage, click on the Zotero button. Click on the show me button to display the instructions. The first step is to create a group library within Zotero, which you can do by clicking on here. You will already need to be signed in or create a Zotero account. Choose a name for your new library group and choose Private Membership. If you want to define sharing settings, you can do so here, but I'll leave this for now. Going back to Epi Reviewer, I advise you to click on Show Me New Tab at Step 3 so that you'll be able to check the instructions as you go. Once you've done that, click on the two checkboxes and click Start Setup, then click OK. Click on Change Permissions and uncheck the Allow Library Access box. Scroll down and click on Per Group Permissions. Find the review you've created and click on Read Write, then save the key. This will return you to the Epi Reviewer interface. If you get this attempt failed message, don't worry, just try again as it happens sometimes. Just go through the steps again. And this time it's worked. To choose the items you want to push to Zotero, select a code from your coding tools. Here, I want to choose all with the include on TNA code. Epi Reviewer has found my 79 items, but to identify which ones don't yet have a PDF, click on More and then choose the filter without docs. I'll now select these 17 items and push them to Zotero. Opening up my Zotero app starts the syncing process and your new library should appear any second. If it doesn't though, click on the green sync button on the right hand side. Once your items appear, select them all, right click and choose find available PDFs. It is advisable to already be connected to your institution's VPN before this. Any PDFs that can be found with your permissions will be added automatically into the library. To upload a PDF manually, double click on an item in Zotero, download the PDF to your computer, then in Zotero, click on the paperclip symbol and choose Attached Stored Copy of File. Find the file and click Open. Now that you have your PDFs in Zotero, go back to Epi Reviewer and click on the refresh icon. You can see here how the items with the PDF now have a green dock symbol next to them. Then click on Pull All and click OK. You can see that the only item in Epi Reviewer now without a PDF is that one. Let's have a quick look at what that looks like within Epi Reviewer now. This item by Watson has just had a PDF added to it, so if we locate that in our list and click on Go, you can now see that it has a PDF attached to it in Epi Reviewer, which you can view by clicking on the green PDF icon at the top or by clicking on the green eye icon. Thanks for watching. Please don't hesitate to contact us at episupport at ucl.ac.uk.